this is Mr. Bob Allen. The question I have for you, is there any schools in your area that say the word karate or karate and they don't teach karate, they teach either Americanized martial arts or taekwondo? Yeah, there's a big school. He has a small chain of schools and it's all the time in the paper about karate. And uh, I very seldom hear him say that they do taekwondo. That's so, their style. Do you think that the American public is confused on what karate really is? Oh yeah, they lump them all together. There's three things. There's traditional karate, and it's from Japan. And karate teaches the respect. It teaches the old ways. And it's very, very hard to learn in a certain way. But yet if you stay with it, it's not. Also, there's American freestyle. Those are the people who couldn't do karate. And they had to change it to what they call still karate today. And then, of course, there's Taekwondo, which is much different, too. Do you think the reason why uh, schools use the word karate is for marketing purposes to bring people in so sure. they can make more money? Sure, that, that's what it is. And so do you think um, maybe the arms, there might be some politics of, if, if there's more money being made by these schools, and that's how they get that big is they use that word karate to make their school bigger, so therefore they have more influence in the community, so therefore they might even have the influence over the newspapers and the media? Sure. Also, you know, when it's uh, to their advantage, they'll say Taekwondo, especially during the Olympics that year, Taekwondo is highlighted, so they'll say that, but they don't do Olympic Taekwondo. And then when it's, uh, they want the public to know that it's a karate, or something like karate, they use that word. Do you think if they use the word martial arts on their name or building, that would be fine? Uh, yeah, sure, I do. Do you think that the word karate should only be uh, only for people that actually teach karate? Yes, I do. It's a Japanese word, it means empty hand, and uh, it should be used only for the karate styles, that's what I do. Is, uh, what area are you uh, in right now? What area, where's your school's at? Uh, Louisiana. Okay. Is there anything else you want to add? Uh, just like to say, I, I lived in Japan for five years, and I'm a lover of the Japanese. And all the martial arts that the world knows are really mainly started in Japan: jujitsu, kendo, karate do. All of them started there. Also, you mentioned earlier that you were a world licensed referee as well. I was a world referee, and now I'm too old to be one. I'm over 60, so but that was the greatest time of my life being a world referee. And how many years did you do that? Uh, about 12, 12 years. All right. Thank you very much, Mr. Allen. Thank you.